this is a video of the little banty chicks sleeping. Of course, they're hearing my voice now, so they're interested in what mom's doing here. <laughs> it's also getting really close to morning. It's about 5.30. The sun will be up in about an hour. And they've been sleeping since 8.30 last night. What I have done... When I first brought the Bantam chicks home three nights ago, all I had for a heat lamp for them was white light. And what they would do all day and all night with the white light was sleep every five or so minutes for about three minutes and then get up and eat and mess around with their scratch that I put in the bottom of their cage, which is grass, just grass from outdoors I've cut into little one inch segments. And then they'd crawl back in their little bed back there under the light and sleep for another three to five minutes and it seemed like to me they were, weren't getting very good sleep. So on the second night, I found this red light for the heat lamp and if I turned the sleep machine on this really delicate cricket sound and put the red light on at about sundown, they fall asleep and they stay asleep all through the night, which is really good and healthy for them because these girls just don't stop during the daytime. They are active in all kinds of little games that baby chicks play and chasing my fingers around and eating and scratching at their, at their scratch on the bottom of the cage. Tomorrow I'm going to run in and get some alfalfa for them so that they can play with that, but I'll still cut it into lengths because I'm afraid one of them's going to get lost in a sea of alfalfa if I don't cut it down to size for them. But anyway, yeah, they're starting to wake up a little bit. It's just so good to see them sleeping all through the night from 8.30 to 5.30. because they're so active during the day, they really need a break, they need to rest and uh, gain some weight and stop moving around so much. They like to get out during the day and flip their wings, practice flying, they like to play little chick games like, um, oh, tag, uh, <laughs> cute little games. They like to get out and see what's going on and dig around in, in things dirt and whatever so they're so active that I really really am so happy to see them sleeping so well at night this is their third night the beginning of their fourth day when the sun lights up the window, I will change out their red light for the white one, and I will change the sleep machine from the silent soft cricket noises to something more daylightish like a brook, babbling brook sound, and then they will be active all during the day, whether they're inside their coop here or playing on the table with me. Oh yeah, <laughs> you know I'm here for sure. And uh, they probably can't see me very well because all the lights are off besides from there. But yeah, I'll try to get a, I'll try to get a video of their activities when they're awake. They're still yawning, picking around at things and preening. But I'll try to get some of their chick games that they play on video for you tomorrow. Good morning, precious. Yes. Good morning, chick, chick, chick. They got one more hour to sleep and then I'll turn the light on. <laughs> 